I just uploaded my cover photo and then I'm gonna put it on Kindle. I'm also gonna put it on CreateSpace, which is Amazon. So what's cool about CreateSpace is that they don't have like a library full of books waiting to be bought. They just have my manuscript and if anyone buys it, they will print it out as a book for that person and send it to them. I mean, it's, ge it's genius. The Modern Dentist by Dr. Joyce Kong. Ah! If you were to ask me a year ago whether I would have ever written a book, no. But this year, I've really pushed myself to do the things that scare me. And here we are. I'm scared, but I'm excited. I sweated real hard, and you guys, I sweat a lot usually. Like, my body is very ladylike in that way. <laughs> and pretty much everyone in the class is fit, and for some reason that really motivates me. I noticed in um, like Newport, Costa Mesa, this is like the outfit for everyone. And when I'm in Brea, I'm the only one in a sports bra. People in Brea like to cover themselves. In Newport, everyone likes to show off their abs. <laughs> and I think like that's Newport Beach currency. Post office. This is the Costa Mesa post office. This is the glam life of being a boss, carrying really heavy flyers into a post office. You want to see a flyer there's my pick this is my office oh my god aren't we so cute Just... byron and i are on our way to eat our favorite shabu shabu restaurant what's it called byron shabu haru okay so this is what i need to do this is what you need to understand okay i don't understand okay you need to stop spending our hsa money on botox that's backup money that we actually need for any medical emergencies. That's why we have the savings. If we use the savings, you can't get Botox. Byron, you can't tell me not to get Botox. We need that money as a backup. Byron. Oh, you're killing me, dude. I can't not get Botox. My face is f***ing important. They have really yummy sauces, rice, and this is their veggie plate, Shabu Haru. Ooh, she brought me extra peppercorn. Mm, I love when the insides are numb. <laughs> Thank you. Ooh. This one is in Costa Mesa. pretty close to my office and I guess it's this guy over here probably needs a lot of work looks pretty old
brunch. Brunch time. A little mimosa to celebrate, perhaps? Yeah, we can do that. When we lived in New York, we had a new brunch spot planned for every weekend. And now we live the suburban life, which means coming to these basic ass places. I still enjoy, and Hercules loves this place. That's the most important. Seriously, her, you have to poo this little after waste an entire bag on this. An entire bag, her, on this. Breakfast of Champions. Fried rice. Lots of carbs, huh? No summer body, huh? Me neither. <laughs> got to Lucy's lashes. I'm getting my lashes redone. Honestly, I don't mind that I have no lashes right now, even though I look like a naked mole rat. But Medcon's coming next week, and I need to have lashes. Uh, sexy rainbow style, come by. Uh huh. Sea curl 13. Sea curl 13. Yeah, I think that looks okay. good. Thank you. Mm -hmm. All right. And ta da! This is a specimen. Mm. It's a clogged follicle. There's a hair that's coming right out of it. I'm gonna pull it. Oh! <laughs> Next time you think, I'm gonna grow a beard. Think about this moment. Link to USC. It is the first day of school today for the ASPID students, which are the international dentists. They're dentists in their own country, but they need to come to the United States and get credentialed and licensed before they can practice dentistry here. We're teaching CAD CAM this morning, and so I'm really excited to go to school. And despite really enjoying my little spring break. Um, it feels nice to be part of a routine again. I just finished the first day. My bag just broke. I just got home from USC. It's around 2 o'clock. I'm going to go to Orange Theory at 3.30. Maybe get my nails done. I hate getting my nails done. We have arrived at Nail Garden. I need to get a pedicure. And I'm very scared. I don't really like pedicures, but you gotta do what you gotta do. Did you guys know that my feet are the part of my body I hate the most. I don't know why I was just born with ogre feet. They're so wide that when I wear Birkenstocks, they fall off the edge. That's how wide my feet are. And each toe, each toe has a lot of juice in it. I always think it's funny when people tell me that um, they have like a foot fetish. And I'm like, <laughs> uh, wait until they see my feet. This is dinner. Byron made these turkey patties. They're very yummy. They have jalapeno in them. This is salad and avocado. And we're eating on paper plates because we're trying to move and we packed all our plates. But this looks so yummy. I'm a flexitarian, so usually I don't eat meat, but I've been having, I've been wanting to have a more wholesome, well-rounded meal because I've been feeling really lightheaded these days. 
So, Byron, bon appetit! Byron's obsessed with these people. They're Australians. Are they Korean? They're Asian Australians. They do a travel vlog. And they're at a capsule hotel, which is what we are dying to do when we go to Japan. What we're also dying to do is get Byron in a pair of circle lenses. Colored ones. Colored circle lenses, like this girl. But the big question is, where are we gonna get you circle lenses? And how big are your eyes gonna look once you get circle lenses? So, my last patient before lunch, I finished him about half an hour early, and I realized I could get in a workout. I'm gonna go to trim and do some Pilates during lunch, and I'll be back in time for my one o'clock patient. One, can you even win this? It says, congratulations again on being named one of 2019 Incisal Edges 40 under 40. Top 40 dentists under 40. Woo! Go me, go me. You know, two years ago, they could have done top for 30 under 30, but they missed that one. Been practicing since 23. Guy's got a... Stay on it. Now I'm 40 under 40. It's making me feel a little bit old here.